Welcome back to No Man's Sky, everybody. This is Elon Paul. We're going to be doing another 30-minute episode of the Permadeath Run. The Permadeath No Starter Ship, No HUD Challenge. Now, my HUD might be on when I get back in here, so I'll turn that off as soon as I jump in. And we'll proceed right where we left off. Now, you'll notice that there's no timer on the screen. There's no use in doing that because I uh, it's been actually two days since I've come back to this. So obviously I can't set the timer for an hour and nine minutes. But you know what? If you know that these are half hour episodes, you know that the first one was about 30 minutes, the second one was about 39 minutes. So you know how long this is taking. And in real game time, it's probably not going to be perfectly accurate. So we'll see how this goes, especially as I go into the escape menu from time to time. Um, time of day it is right now. There's literally no one in the house but me. And I've got a new microphone and everything like that, a new setup, a new shock. Uh, mount so things will sound a little different especially with um, uh, the fact is i'm using the G, uh, geforce rtx uh, voice suppression a noise suppression i should say so hopefully it'll sound a little bit better it tends to cause problems i've been noticing that my uh, graphics card has been working a little bit harder lately so we just make sure hud is disabled there we go yes i'm applying it <clears throat> okay so here we are Back where we started. Now I've been heading in that general direction. And we're going to continue to head in that general direction. And we've picked up some supplies on the way. As you know. We've got some stuff. Some stuff worth money. Uh, the background audio should be in pretty good shape. So hopefully you can hear it a little bit. I do. I did notice it is a little bit low right now. Let me just adjust that real quick. There we go. That should be better. Okay. So you can pick up the audio a little bit better. All right. So we're heading this general direction. We do have our visor, but we got to be looking very, very carefully. High points are our friends. We want to go for areas like that that have things on them. Uh, we were just fortunate enough to find a building that we could step into. So, And we do have a hazard shield, so at least that's something, right? All right. A little bit of a cave here? Nope, just a hole. All right, and we'll get up to the next high peak once we get, uh, yeah, once I can get myself acclimated to what I'm doing here. Hey, what do you think, launch fuel? Uh, no idea what it gave me. No clue, probably nanites. Okay. Uh, we don't really, I, I, is this the one that gives us life support? I will take that. I will see you, life support. There we go. And let's look for some buried technology. Now, I got some people leaving comments, and I really appreciate the comments, folks. By all means, as much of as advice as you like to give, I appreciate it. Kindly remember that by the time you leave the comment, I am going to be long gone from this area. So telling me, hey, there was a... Uh, that unit you were looking for was to the left. Well, guess what? This isn't a live stream, so... It's not going to help me at this time. But I know a lot of people say it's usually down this way or it's usually over here. I have literally found it everywhere in various different directions. Sometimes I don't find it at all. As you can see, there it is right now. All the way over to one side. There we go. All right. Let's get out of here. All right, so our planet, I believe, is to the right. It's over there beyond that hill. So let's head towards the hill. And we're going to be trying to keep our eyes open on anything we can find. Thermal protection is falling. That's good to know. There we go. Because we know that our hazard shield is depleted, but we got plenty of batteries. So we should be in good shape. I really like this new Hypercast solo. HyperX. HyperX solo cast. Um, that tap to mute is really handy when you want to clear your throat or something like that. So, Alright, we're up high. Take a look around. Oh, is that... No, those are just plants. Okay. Look for smoke rising, by all means. Maybe we'll find a crash ship. That's really what I'm hopeful for, is the old crash ship routine. Mm, I think 
It's getting low. Eat that up real quick. Got plenty. We should have enough oxygen to get us by, but we got life support gels, right? We do have enough of those. We have one. And yeah, we're okay on that. Let's make some more. There we go. Good shape there. Copper. It's good to know we can find plenty of copper here, but as you know, I'd like to find some phosphorus, because then I wouldn't need my batteries anymore. Nice red patch on the ground. That's what we're looking for. Of course, this won't tell me what they are. So we just have to make do. It's been an interesting uh, couple days. I'm glad I did take off from work today. Very handy to do so. Yep. There we go. That's not where I wanted to put it. <laughs> that was a waste. There we go. Ah, stupid happens. We all do stupid things at, at times, so, you know, it is what it is. Learn from it, if you can. That's life. Life is learning. Hard time getting my son to understand that, too, as well as my ki all my kids, really, you know, my daughters as well. Uh, my son had the hardest time, though. He'd get into class and they'd give him a task to do because they're teaching him and then he would get so upset when he couldn't do it. It's like, you're not supposed to know how to do it. You're learning how to do it. That's the point. That is why we go to shul. Hello. I'll take that. A little bit of condensed carbon didn't hurt anybody. Unless the sentinels attack me, of course. There we go. Alright, we want to head in that general direction, so we'll take you and get across this gully. There we go. And it looks like we have phosphorus right over there. Excellent. I'll go grab that, and then we don't need my ba those batteries anymore. We can recharge our shield with it. Yeah, and let's keep our eyes peeled. And if you do hear any noise in the background, hopefully not. Hopefully my noise suppression is working fine, and the 453 filters I have in OBS are doing their trick as well. But there is a roof getting put on one of the houses that was damaged in the recent hurricane force winds we had here. So... There's that. Alright. Get a quick little boost over here. Looks like we got a machine over there too. Damaged machinery. Alright. Let's see how much of this we can gather up. So... As you know, our stacks are reduced to, I think, 300, if I remember correctly. Let's see how much we got. 73. That's nowhere near enough. Nice. Good deal. So I want about 300. We're not going to use much. It only takes, like, about a dozen to maybe 20 at a time to charge up your shield maximum. But this is definitely useful a useful pause. How much we got? 177? Ah, daytime. Good. I'll be able to see a little bit more during the day than we can at night in this landscape. How are we doing? About ten minutes in. Not quite. Like I said, we're going to keep an eye on this. We're going to do these in half-hour increments. 
All right, let's see. Getting close to the 300. Yes, we are. 291. Three hundred. Put you over there. So how much does it take? That was six, and that was fourteen. So twenty. It took twenty. There we go. There. Okay. Good. Ah. What do you know? Unburied technology. See if we can get maybe another hazard shield. That would be pretty cool. Maybe a jetpack boost. We get nanites. Sucker. Okay. Moving on. How, how, how are we doing on the condensed carbon? 187. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Looks like we're running low on, on uh, that. I'm going to go ahead and boost that up as well. I just want to have a little bit more of that because it'll come in handy for charging my, uh... But now we don't need the batteries anymore, you notice that? So I'll, I'll, rather than waste the resources, I'm going to use them up. And we'll go from there. Is this a pretty tall place? Yeah, let's get up to the top of this. Go up the ridges a little bit. And see if we can take a look around. Because we're at a good, good spot right now. We've got phosphorus, we've got oxygen, we've got life support gels. We're in good shape. Let's take a look and see if we find anything. Hey, we found a structure. That's good. That's really good. Structures are always good. Take a close look because you never know when you might see something like that. Not that that's going to help us at all. Okay, we might have to head to that structure over there and see if we can get any resources from it. Anything else down here? No? I don't see anything. So remember... Going up to these tall places, whoops, sorry about that. Going up to these tall places are very handy. Okay, just wanted to do something real quick so I could watch my video card. A little bit care carefully. Alright, the, oh, the, the video is going good on it. So far, so good. I don't think it's going to cause any problems. We've had some jitters, is why I was a little bit worried. I damaged myself a little bit there. I don't know. Kind of hard to tell. We should have something over there. Oh, what kind of resources do we have? And this one's not abandoned. That's good. Although finding a uh, nice... That's not what I was trying to go for, but okay. Just saved our game. Just trying to get something out of the yellow box. Hey, what do we got? Hey, ammunition that we don't need. All right, why am I... Oh, my jetpack's been damaged. Look at that. Wondering why I wasn't boosting ahead, and I need more ferrite. Let's make sure it isn't something I don't need. All right. That restores your shield, even though I don't have to worry about it. Now... This could find something for us. The thing is, is that we our HUD doesn't work, so if it works, it will at least give us an overview of the area. Maybe I can see something. So let's just go ahead and do it. Um, 217... Right? 2170? Okay. Alright, so let's take an overview. Hopefully no clouds are in the way. They're not. I think I see something to the right over there. So the way that thing is pointing in that general direction, it's to the right. So it should be in that general direction that way. There might be something over there. Let's go take a look. And remember to get some ferrite because we need it for our next repair. I 
angered, I angered the Girl Scout cookie gods, I guess, or something, I don't know. So, to me, it looked like there was something in this general direction. I don't know what, but I figured, hey, let's just take a look. I'm punching in the air. That's right. Maybe it's nothing, but it, to me, it was worth checking it out, you know? Let's get up to the top of this thing. Maybe we can take a closer look. It's a weirdly shaped planet. I mean, that one planet I was on when I did one of these runs, which had some very high and then uh, these high, like, plateaus, were, was just awesome for looking around. Protection 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 um, okay. There we go. See? Alright. Now that I'm really focused on looking. See, that's what I thought I saw. I think I saw some kind of, of darkness on the ground, which can indicate a landing spot. Possibly. Let's get over to that ridge over there. Let's see what we have to see. Is that... No, that's nothing. Okay, good. Let's go over this way. Well, I'm really taking some chances with that, uh, aren't I? Just so we can get some more life support jokes. I know I'm going to be running low again soon. Because I really think they've made some adjustments to it. I think, uh, life support drops a lot quicker in these permadeath runs now. <clears throat> I think that little ridge right there ought to be a good spot. on the ground. Yep, running is not going to work here. That's for sure. Well, we do it immediately, but we only use one gel. Good that I heard it that time. I was paying closer attention to it. Alright, let's look back the way we came just in case. Make sure I'm not missing anything. Okay, over here, looks okay. Yeah, I see these weird scars on the land are just what, what gets me every time. Alright, let's get to this machinery here real quick. Really could use a jetpack boost. Nope, more nanites. Sometimes it's deeper in the ground than we want. So we'll go just a little bit darker. Oh, that, nope, that was just a rock. And if you get close, it'll be sometimes a glow around the ground. Oh, there she is. Okay. How many do we get? Ah, good deal. Let's uh, use up some of this stuff and get it out of my inventory. Alright, good. Up to the top of the ridge. Back that way, just to make certain. Wouldn't it be nice to look over the top of one of these ridges and say, Hey, look, a crashed ship. That would be freaking awesome. But I am not going to hold my breath. But I have gotten fortunate before. Stumbled across some lost, some, some broken ships on occasion. 
good spot for it over there. Hey guys, where you headed? So now they're headed in the general direction that I would like to go, so... If they dart left or right, I'm going to be upset. I'd rather them dart right. Okay, good. Right it is, so... There should be something in that general direction. They're really taking a sharp turn, so... I don't know, maybe they're trying to tell me something. You can also watch for circling as they go in that direction. If they start circling a platform, then we'll know. Alright, I don't see anything over this way. Yeah, not really in the mood. Let's head for the mountains, I guess, over there. Boy, is this Mars-like or, or what? Ah, did I just damage something again? No, I'm good. Get this piece of broken machinery here. I believe 20 minutes have passed already. We'll probably hit the 35 minute mark before we stop though, just as, as a note. Really like the new graphics they have on these things. And then you know you've been there. Okay. Everybody goes, like, in this general direction now, because they say it does show up over there, but I've had it shown up in several different spots now. Yep, there it is this time. Behind it, to the left. Got it? Okay. Ooh, made myself some holes to dig out of, eh? How are we doing? Yeah, okay. That's not what we're looking for. Almost did it again. Alright. Doing good. Get rid of those. We don't need them. Hey, let's put, move you over here where you're more useful. Move you. Move you. Move you. Put you back over here. Put you up here. Okay, good. Moving on. Look at all these nice supplies that somebody left behind. That was brilliant. Good job. I wanted that resource and I just blew it out of existence. Wonderful. There we go. Hey, not bad. All right, good, good, good. Excellent. Alright, so where's my uh, planets at? I'm gonna go this way. Oh, one of these hills. Okay. Our best option here... Oh, pardon me. Looks like we can go underneath. Brilliant. Oh, that's great. Excellent. Set up straight. I'm gonna hurt my back if I start sitting up straight more. Alright, we wanna get up to a ridge somewhere so we can take another close look around. Now that we're past that promontory. Okay, let's see. That would be a nice big hill to go up on top of. Check over here. Lots of puffs of smoke from the stupid plants. Oh. Damaged machinery too, so when we come across a crashed ship, it might be hard to see. Of course, you know what's funny is, I, I, you know, there's no coordinates or anything, so if you see something in my video and say, Hey, Paul, you missed it. I'm like, oh, crap. There's really nothing I can do to go back. Because I can't exactly go back to some place when I have no idea where in the world I'm going. So, keep that in mind. I know there's some machinery over there. Wow. See what I mean? Going through that stuff like uh, gummy bears. Like 
Gummy bears in a kindergarten class. Yep. A little bit of music in the background. Hopefully it doesn't get picked up here. I always like to have something on the... Uh... Oh, I hate that. You're going up a steep hill. Come on, give me a break. Boost. 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 Yeah, come back in a half hour, right? Good grief. Yeah, we can't see anything from here. <laughs> yeah, we gotta go a little further. Good time, though. Time of day. It's almost nightfall again. There's another ridge right in front of me. Let me go ahead and head that direction. Maybe we'll get fortunate. Hey, you got some life support stuff over there. I'll take it. Looks like my hazard protection's dropping. It shouldn't be. I mean, it's right where it needs to be. Oh my gosh, really? Uh, these rolling hills. It's going to be getting kind of tough to see anything. I'm going to have to go to side to side in order to find anything here. Hmm. Okay. Let's move on. Maybe this ridge up here will be better. Let me see. What did you guys give me? Let me see. Why am I in there? Uh, hazard protection, which we don't need. See what I mean about the life support? Alright, what do we got? Uh, got some stuff I can pick up, that's about it. I don't see anything else. Grab it. It's it's literally right here. I walked right past it. Okay. Wow. All right. Where are we at? Just about the 30 minute mark now, so we're not going to go much further before we uh, toss a towel out for a little bit. Now these runs, I don't usually like to go longer than about two hours before I literally give up, because then it's just getting ridiculous. Because we're doing this in 30 minute increments on these videos, I will oblige to go a little longer. Maybe I'll hit the three hour mark, because again, I really think they've started to make these more difficult. They've adjusted some settings in the permadeath rules, and I think it's making an impact on how well you can do. Yeah, hazard protection's getting too low. Okay. All right. Let's continue on. I don't see anything. Doesn't mean anything, but, you know... Oh, great. Did I break anything? Landed a little too hard. I like to sometimes use the rocks to hit. There we go. Because, um... They stop you immediately. And it's really worth... Worth it to do so. Let's just put it that way. Alright, we got a couple of broken pieces of machinery over there. Let's go ahead and hit one of those. On the top of the ridge. There we go. Hey. You never know, right? Oh, that one, that gave us something. 
I don't know what. So, there's the front of the unit. Let's just say it's supposed to be all the way over to this side. Because I don't think it is. No, see, I don't think so. Let's go to the other side. And... You can see as well as I do, it's not there. Was it under my feet? I see no glows in the rocks. So this one is... Oh, there it is. There she is. Okay. It's good that we're doing it this way. All right. Good that we're doing it this way. So let's give it just a few more minutes, get up to another ridge, and then we'll call this episode. What do we get out of that? Looks like more nanites, I'm guessing. No, no, no. I got condensed carbon out of that last one. Alright. Almost at the top of this ridge. And then I think we're going to call this for one more episode. See something metal and shiny in the distance, but I don't think it's anything more than a deposit. Yes, that's that's all it was. What about down here? Anything over here? No, nothing I can see. Gotta take a close look. You never know. Don't want to miss anything. Another piece of broken machinery. Okay, we've got a higher ridge over there. Maybe we'll go ahead and just do our due diligence. Get over to the higher ridge and then just call it. This one's not going to have much for us over here, but... That's a good spot. Again, metal in the distance, in the ground, probably possibly paraffinium or something like that. I don't know what that was about. Uh, let's see. Not seeing much. That's the one I really would like to reach. Where's the planets? They're behind me, though, so I'm going the wrong way. We want to hit that ridge. So, we've started going the wrong way, so it's a good idea to use something as your compass. Since you're not given one. With no HUD. Alright, sounds like our hazard protection has just died again. And I almost guarantee you my life support is getting low again. Yep, it is. Uh, that sounded like a stampede. I mean, holy mackerel. All 
Alright. I'm doing that because I need life support gel. Alright, we're going to get up to this top of ridge over here, and that's going to be the end of our episode. And then we'll pick up again on the next episode. But I can't get those glowing crystals, huh? Take a little bit of a shortcut. Always use that stuff. And now. I always know when it's going to end. And yeah, I mean, we could be sitting here looking side to side as well. But our, our initial view from a distance should be enough. To get us, you know, get us a good view of what we're looking for. Alright, here we go. See if we can get up to the top of this without it telling us. Nope, sorry, you don't get a boost. Yep. One more. There we go. And all we see is another valley. Uh, actually, that's the tallest peak over there. Let's head over there. Oh, we're gonna hurt ourselves on that one. Anything break? No? Okay, good. Oh, wait a second. That's good. Guess what we get to get build? Nice. Okay, good. We need more carbon, though. Not condensed carbon, just regular carbon. Hey, how about some oxygen while we're here? Just need a little bit more carbon. We can build one more. Need three carbon. There we go. That way it's gonna work for me there. Okay. Alright, we're almost at the top here. Wow. Okay, this was a good one. Let's take a good close look around if we can, and this will be our last view from this episode. Besides lots of plants and more hills, I see absolutely nothing. Would you agree? Nothing. Nothing, I tell you. Okay. We don't really need to charge anything at this point, but I'm probably going to record one more episode after this, and we're going to go ahead and call this one. So, and we'll name this particular one. Let's pull back a little bit. I don't know what we're going to name it yet. You'll find out later. But that's a nice picture for the episode, don't you think? How about... Yeah, that looks a little better. You know, we could cheat a little bit and take a look around at the sunlight, but it doesn't really make a difference. Not going to find anything. That's a nice picture. Okay, so we're going to call it here, folks. Thanks for watching, and we are going to see you in the next episode. Thank you very much. Take care.